A big win for McNeese. Congratulations to the Cowgirls. But we head to Moss Bluff now as Sam Houston hosted Haughton tonight. And boy, oh boy, did Big Sam jump all over the Buccaneers in the second. After plating one in the first inning, the Broncos smacked back to back to back home runs. Briley Fontenot, Carol Eadson, and Lexi Diblin all hit home runs in that order. And Dibley was dealing on the mound as well. Lady Broncos cruise 14-1 to the final score in five innings. And with it, they're moving on to the quarterfinals and take a look at this. Iway down 3-2, to two, two runners on. Cameron Broussard at the plate and she launches one, sending it over the wall. That's a walk-off three-run home run as Iway beats Iota 5-3 to three. and with it, Broussard sends the Lady Jackets into the non-select Division 2 quarterfinals. What a moment. Congratulations to Iowa. And we had some other local teams in action tonight as well. Barb season unfortunately came to an end. They narrowly fell to West Monroe. Once again, Iowa beat Iota 5-3. Jennings' season comes to an end as well. They get upset 7-3 by Franklin Parrish. De Quincy took it to Oberlin. They win it 14 to nothing in five innings. Oakdale tops Maryville in six, 11-1 the final there. And finally, Pitkin falls to Anacoco 5-3 the final score.